Welcome back to uh, me being stranded on the island. <laughs> Even though I lost my crew members, but my uh, my my click is with me at the moment. So I have one. I'm gonna need three. Stop at a later time, but it's it's fine. I'm not worried too much about it because Merley's here. Table four. <laughs> no, you don't. Ooh, they're really lucky there. How about another fire drive? Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh, and I thought that was gonna freeze, though. Would have made my job easier. <clears throat> Oh, sure, I won't tell. Mario! <laughs> there's a guy hot- hey, there's a guy disguising as a pirate- there, the ex knots are disguising as pirates and you need to get rid of them. And then he just jumps out of the darn screen and just be like, WHAT DID I TELL YOU?! And I'm just like, I don't know. <laughs> I was just doing what you exa- uh, what you told me to. And he's just like, what? I didn't tell you to do that. Yes, you did. You specifically was talking to me, saying that it's obvious who you are, and I was to tell Mario. <laughs> and then he's just like, why, Ayana? <gasps> are you cursing? How dare you? to, uh, coconut bombs. But obviously I can't make anything with them because I don't have anything, uh... I don't have a... a toad chef to do so. So I'm basically just gonna keep them in the arsenal for now. I'm just gonna have to look. Uh, um, no. I'm gonna take that off. Um, I'm 
They don't need Mega Rush on. Um, yeah, my partners don't need Mega Rush on. I mean, if they were in danger, well, then they have Power Rush to look forward to. I'll just make Head Rattle much more stronger. Confusion is the most broken um, status effect in the easy darn game, so. I'm giving my enemies what they ask for when they throw it at me. Tell you guys something. Like, um, it's, it's basically about my uh, personal life. Um, I actually just uh, went practice driving uh, a couple of times today. I mean, not today, but yesterday and today, uh, with my family and uh, by myself. 
and it turns out that I actually drove pretty well for my first, uh, like, from my, from my first time with my, my, my step-pop, and I drove all by myself, just, um, keeping their, t hey, keeping his, uh, his teaching in mind. It turns out, driving is actually pretty fun. <clears throat> but, uh, at the same time, I just don't know if I'm, I really want to do it all, uh, do it often. Like, not only, like, like to, I only would like to, like, drive whenever I'm, like, you know, like, going, uh, going somewhere that is important. But, it turns out, I don't even know if I should really do it often. But at the same time, it's like nothing. But there are certainty of things that are actually stressful for it, because like, uh, the, like, the turns and such. Even though I just got done talking to my mother about this. But, um... Like, the... The turns are a bit weird, but, like... Don't you think that, uh, like... I am worrying too much about the turns, because I haven't gotten to that part yet, but, um... I have been using the signal lights... Uh, the, the, the signal lights for it. same time, I just don't know if I really want to do, do it often. But, uh, I say wish me luck on me getting my license, though. It's like, I will be taking the test, uh, Soon. But, uh, thing is, I don't want to get behind the wheel and try to, like, just drive. No. I actually want to put, uh, like, putting forth the time and effort to actually start practice. Driving is really, really, um, really, really important, but at the same time, you can't, I can't do it while I'm on the highway or anything, even though I have not been doing that at all. But, uh, I actually want to dish out all the funny BS that I, that you usually discover about me, and try to take things more seriously. Cause I am getting, uh, getting to that point, and, uh, like, getting to that point in my age where I'm actually going to be a lot more mature, and that's what I really desire. But at the same time, I am a young, uh, I am a young adult. Well, I guess we'll just leave him here to just take a dirt nap. Or I can just do this. <laughs> He's still alive, you bozo.
that I could just use fire drive. I don't really have to put forth the effort of uh, taking my time with this. Besides, these guys are weak. Fire drive gets the work done. Flavio just gets on, on Mario's back.
<laughs> All of that mysterious aura, you're just like, <gasps> until then it just open, it, until then the wall just opens and you're just like, oh, well it just died. Okay. I'm gonna draw you guys a new deathbed. And it's gonna hurt, seriously. jump over here and get this. There's no challenge in that at all. Oh! In here I thought it was close. Uh, here I thought it was a... Uh...
piercing blow. Did you lock the door when you left? Yeah, I did. I mean the house door. I did. Sorry guys, that was my mom. Uh, that was my mom talking about. Uh, did I lock the door after uh, after going back? Uh, like after um going to practice drive. Oh my god, Marley with the save! Holy crap! Oh yeah, this is gonna hurt the cannon and he's gonna die. I don't know what to do. Should I throw coconuts at it? Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> well, in my mind, I was asking, uh... Can I, can I super guard this? Oh no, not these things. I can actually come back and, like, get... Bella to uh, look up these things. Yeah, who needs defense when I have a defense piercer? my job easier. Oh, I should have stole its item! And I killed it accidentally! Did a little bit of damage. <laughs> Beetles, man. How the heck do you have way more defense than uh, an average Koopa Trooper? That's that's beyond crazy. 
And of course, these things are really, uh, these things' defense are really high. They're much higher than a Koopa's. This kind of reminds me of that one fighting stage in Tekken 5. You know, the treasure, uh, the pirate stage. Even though it's kind of just like this, in a way. Uh, I hope they make it, uh, uh, like, I hope they make another stage like that. But this time being on the pirate ship instead. Oh, that'd be cool as hell. But I believe it was just like that. <clears throat> like, not just a wreckage of the pirate uh, pirate ship. No, I mean being on it while it's on on open water, just tilt and uh, just slightly tilting. I mean, have the background seem like you're actually tilting in the boat while it's just turning sideways. <laughs> can still steal his item. you gonna do? Oh. Well, the audience can back you up, but, uh, no throwing stuff in the background. Gonna slap you silly!
No, that's not gonna work, because they'll attack each other and multiply each other. So, no, we're not doing that. Deathbed it is! I thought that would work. <laughs> this is what happens when you can't. Uh, this is what happens when you try to defy video game logic. Defy logically, I do defy logic. And when is that bullet bill ever coming back? It's been gone for like a few seconds. Dry. God. Get to hell. Normally, I would have been like, does head rattle work on these things? And I'm just like, dude, they're fucking inanimate objects that are alive somehow in the Mario world. Like, anything doesn't even make sense here. So, of course, hitting this thing with confusion does not work. 
Because it doesn't have eyes and it can't feel. It's an inanimate object. But it can shoot stuff at us. Consecutively. But you can slap it silly. Oh, <laughs> it hit the wall. <laughs> hey, I want to be able to fly a little faster. I can't control how fast you fly. Well, uh, hell, you, you know, buy me a jetpack. Hey, hey, make him buy me a jetpack. Hey, get off me, you stupid black motherfucker. You guys are getting any of that stuff. We use the old strategies and that's final. What about the princess? What about her? I think we ought to be able to have sex with her, too. What? Well, wait, what? Hell, I mean, she's your girlfriend, right? So, uh, you know, how can only one prevent him get the fuck the princess? Oh, wait, wait, hold, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Hey, you told me she was your daughter. Um, hey, you told me she was your sister. How did I dodge all four of those blasts? But Virgil got the worst. How do I dodge all of them like that? No, I can't say that. Need this. This is a super mushroom. It's okay though. Still need that. It's pretty important. Thanks, Marley. But at the same time, you could have used that on, uh, Cortez. But overall, thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 
I wonder that too, Coops. I wonder that too. Or it just likes to just meddle around with her emotions. What were you doing above, uh, above there? What were you doing up there? You have that much health in this thing. This should be the stronger one while you're the weaker one. myself a huge never mind. Better. <laughs> I was about to say I'd be doing myself a huge disservice if I do that. But it's okay. They divide it. Uh, uh, they divide it. And the explosion from that, uh, and the explosion made it a little bit more easier, uh, to take them out. Let me guess. Dank, murky water? Reeks worse than your breath at an oyster fest? More metal heads than your plate on a one-pass buffet? And of course, weapons are as lethal than your ever so-called tiny whities on a hot summer day. <laughs> Look, Donut Hole, why don't we float around looking hot and heavy, and you go to Rotor Root the Pipes! <laughs> I'm 
we're oh god. <laughs> we're not doing anything until you tell us why are the metalheads trading with the Baron's forces. We're trying to both need captain. All I know is that the Baron cut a desperate deal with the metalhead he Yeah, well how long can that deal last? Well, Baron is running short on eco, eh? Metalheads are running short on patience. <clears throat> Baron needs this to keep in power, otherwise he'd go find the true ruler on the throne, wherever that little brat is. <laughs> Daxter and I will clear your sewers. And we haven't forgotten about that weapons upgrade you promised in return. Blood suckers. Just like a little bit. Gotta keep dodging. You're doing great. Just don't let up. Sure, I'm on my way. <laughs> Huge disappointment. Kind of like this. Like that Tekken stage that I was talking about. Like, have it just be like that. I can just defy logic again. Nope. <laughs> Not likely. That one's too far out. Jesus.
I need these because I'm I am gonna be going back down into the pit of 100 trials. Warning. Come inside the door and be lost to darkness. Spooky ooh, business. I am a parrot, blasted. Parrots do not moan. I am a cold blooded villain who robs innocence of life and loot. Not a crying ghost. Then you are at on my treasure. And this is my ship. We, hey, what are you doing here? Abra, speak. I'll turn your mustache into a bone polisher. <laughs> you three is kind of fun. <laughs> Maybe I'll keep you around. <laughs> I don't know what I'm laughing at. <laughs> so stop laughing! I should have turned off the uh, nostalgic tunes before I got in here, but at the same time, it's okay. This thing goes fucking hard. Hmm. I wonder if I can actually head rattle you. Let's see. Oh yeah, I can. <laughs> Even the dead can be confused.
Yeah, I can't punch his bone eh, his pile of bones over there because they're spikes. <laughs> he still can't attack. Better confuse him quick before he actually does something crazy. And he's dizzy. Wow, I believe that uh, that attack may miss. It may. the save, trying to end these fights quickly. Now he's nothing but a floating head this time. Here in a ragmail. Yeah, I'll just zap all of you. Yeah, how's that feel? Whew, I thought I missed it. Yay, I looked out again. This this calls for something special. Now you will see the true might of my spirit farm. <gasps> no, Loki! You fiend! You you killed my brother! Vivian, you know what to do. No, you don't. Got it. Oh, 
Look at it. Alrighty, did really well. Indeed, or I am not dead. Well, technically, I was already dead, but my spirit will endures. Hide my treasure. So you cannot do anything to me. I do not leave. Still, guarding the treasure for hundreds of years is almost as boring as death. What? Hey, you are not even interested in my treasure? Signore Stupido, then why are you here? <clears throat> huh? In serio? You want this? Oh yeah. This is Jorak over here? Are you serious? Well, this is a big deal. Here, take it. What do I need uh, one or two extra gems for? I do not really like that one. We got the blue crystal star donut. End of chapter. Cortes, scourge of the seas. Mario soundly defeated this fearful spirit and claimed the crystal star. Perhaps the peaceful citizens of the world no longer need fear Cortez and his fell ship. The only problem remaining is how Mario will escape this isolated island. And could there be another problem still hiding beneath our hero's nose? Monyo, that should do it. If you don't need anything else, away with you! And then I heard my and then I heard something in my ears I could not believe. We had actually discovered the legendary treasure of the pirate King Cortez. Okay, I think that'll be all for now. Uh, I'm gonna go in- eh, uh, we'll go into the next part of this, uh, like, the next part of the chapter in the new episode. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and ring that bell to stay up to date on most of the videos I'll be putting out on my channel soon and in the future. See you later!